Hi, I'm John Blazer, Director of Applications Engineering and Efficient Power Conversion. Today, I would like to talk to you about LiDAR, lasers, and EGAN FETs. First of all, what is LiDAR? LiDAR is a way of measuring distance remotely using a laser to send out an optical pulse and then timing how long it takes to receive the reflection. And from this, you can measure the distance accurately. So a typical LiDAR system might measure millions of data points in one second, and it can use these data points to recreate a 3D image or map of the surroundings. This is obviously very useful for applications like autonomous vehicles, but it also turns out to be useful for things like factory automation, security and facial recognition, and a wide variety of other applications. Now let's talk about what a laser driver needs to do. So every LiDAR system has a laser as a, at its core, and in order to make this operate, we need to turn the laser on and off to generate the light pulse. So this seems very simple. Basically, you take a laser and you have a source of electrical energy, and you use a semiconductor switch to turn this on and discharge the energy through the laser generating the pulse. The difficulty or challenges arise when you realize that this pulse needs to be very high power in order to see far, and the pulse also needs to be extremely short on the order of just a few nanoseconds or shorter in order to get good distance resolution, say on the centimeter scale. So this turns out to be a very challenging kind of problem. And there's two things that are the big limitations in a LiDAR system. One of these is stray inductance in the circuit, and the other is the semiconductor switch itself. So we've taken a, a lot of, put in a lot of effort in order to generate circuits with very low inductance. And that has so far left the limiting factor to be the semiconductor switch. So one of the ways you one of the ways you counteract the remaining inductance is by increasing the voltage. What this means is the semiconductor switch has to be a high voltage switch, have high current capability, and still be extremely fast. So this is, of course, this is a natural fit for EGAN FETs. So EGAN FETs can do high voltage, high current, in single digit nanosecond times, and they're the obvious choice for this kind of application. What we see here is three of the EPC 9126 laser driver demo boards with the center board driving the laser to an optical receiver so we can look at the optical waveform. The EPC 9126 laser driver demo board has everything you need to drive a lasers at very high currents with very short pulses. It also has a number of built-in high-speed test points so you can look at the waveforms and everything else you need to drive the laser. So if we take a look at the waveforms, on the left-hand side, I'm showing the laser, the diode currents in each of the three different lasers, and on the right-hand side, I have the optical output. Now, if we take a look at the scale on this side, it's one nanosecond per division and 20 amps per division. So if you take a look at the highest power laser here, it's actually reaching a peak current of over 70 amps with a half-height pulse width of less than two nanoseconds. And if you take a look at the other lasers, you'll see the current is a little lower and they're a little bit wider. And this is due to the different inductance of the different laser packages. So really, in, at this point, the switch really has almost no effect on the driver and everything is about the parasitic inductance of the laser package. And if we take a look at the right, we can see the optical output of the uh, laser B in the middle. And as we can see, we had a very nice, clean optical pulse, about two nanoseconds wide. The superior performance of EGAN FETs and ICs enables groundbreaking LiDAR performance. The ability to generate high current pulses of single digit nanosecond width and to deliver hundreds or even thousands of watts out of a few square millimeters is truly amazing. GAN is a key factor in making possible affordable, high-performance LiDAR, thus fueling the LiDAR revolution. For more information or to purchase demo boards, visit www.epc-co.com.